part of the show. Listen, I encourage y'all to send some more part of the shows, and you niggas keep paying. Like, send it in. <laughs> I mean, in their defense, we can do it for a little while. I get it. But yeah, but then they them, kept paying, so yeah, send, send it in. in. And we got to start so calling we them back. Some shit. We got to start calling them. Make Let me read you part. some of these questions, and you'll understand why I have not been calling them. Erickson, here's one for you. Would you rather s- That is from uh, Pizza and Donuts. Oh, he asked a bunch of questions. Oh, he asked all of us questions. Oh, let's see. For Ice, would you rather skin Mariah Lynn or Demi Lovato? For Parks, <laughs> would you rather MMF and be included with your wife or allow her the two-guy fantasy and not be involved? Neither. <laughs> For Corey, how did Corey get here? <laughs> How many bench press reps of 225 can you do? <laughs> and if you were paid, could you get Ice, Ish, and Joe and Parks to get into shape? Oh, man. For Ish, if you were single, would you date a black woman long term and be as serious with her as you are with your current woman? <laughs> Yo, niggas got to stop putting that narrative on Ish. Not too much on Ish. They got to stop niggas it. Niggas huh? got to stop. It's a dead ass. They I'm, stop I'm it. your true friend and love you. They got to stop. And don't really care. These niggas is trying. Yo, not too much on Ish. <laughs> Yo. Corey Erickson. All right, that's all ish. Oh, he's here's one for Alex. Oh, that's the. All right, we're done with him. Uh, let's see. Here's another one. Has ish ever told this from E? It's from E. Erickson? No, just E. That's why I'm not calling these people. Has ish ever told someone in business or for his advantage that he is half white or mixed? That question's for you, not me. So you got to No, you dumbass. So don't, don't insult No, no, why you got to insult him? Because I'm not half white and but I'm not mixed. He didn't say he, he was asked, half white. He said, have he you said, told have you ever told somebody to use to, it to your advantage? That's what he said. Don't diss him. Because you could pass for half white. That's so he's e. saying, has you, yeah, that's talk to E. e. Don't do that's that. That's your man. Just I don't know, E. He's a fan so of yours. So you could diss him? He, don't diss him. He's paying you. That's He's trying to be funny. But no, I'm not half white. So no, I wouldn't ever say I'm half white or mixed. I'm not mixed. You would never do that even to no, have an advantage. Fuck? No. So Got like it. if the police was on some shit. And, no. You know, okay. I'm just Here's a question from Mo. See, we just did like five of these. Mixtapes. I'm in the middle of watching the Jada Kiss pod and I stopped to send this in. I think it'd be dope if y'all did a pod where y'all rank and discuss the top favorite and most impactful mixtapes mix out, especially before the streaming era. The importance and impact that each of them had. Oh, uh, Yeah. I don't do that because I feel like we do that all the time. I don't think that there's too many mixtapes that matter. That's me. Wayne got two series that's important. Mm -hmm. 50 got a few series that's important. Mm -hmm. My Moo Music shit is important. Mm -hmm. Kendrick Section 80. Cole got one. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm forgetting somebody who got a... Jada Kiss. Yeah. Jada Kiss, the champ is here. All of that shit is important. Them locks uh, mixtapes. For sure. Uh, 21 Savage. Yeah. Has a mixtape series that is important to people. Not for nothing, Chance. The uh, coloring book was very important in what it did. That is true. Chance. Who are we missing? In You're this? missing Jeezy. You missing? I don't know. Gucci. I don't know about Jeezy's mixtape run. I don't. Okay. Well, let me. That mixtape run is what led to the album of of the classic TM 101. Your Trap or Die mixtape series, which you hear him and Drama talk about, that was the one that really... Oh, Trap or Die. Yeah. I guess that is a mixtape series. Yeah. Well, no, that's not a series. I mean, there were ones after, but his run, his Gangster Grills, his run... Drama, there. of course. Yeah. You got... Gucci, you have to name yeah, as well, Gucci, even though I'm not as there. familiar. I'm not as familiar with T.I.'s mixtape. T.I.'s had a little... Um, and you got to mention the pre-artist uh, exclusive mixtapes, the Clues and mm -hmm. everyone else. That's that what was, I, I don't yeah. know about the mother shit y'all talking about, but I know about Clue. I know about Ron G started with a bunch of DJ yeah. mixtapes. I think they're yeah. talking about... Yeah, no, no. Artists. Yeah. But I mean, I think it should be noted at least. Yeah. And if you're just talking impactful mixtapes, you got to you, you know, you gotta mention Currency, what he's done with the mixtape game. True. Fact. Um... Wiz Currency and Wiz Those are the two yeah. I was forgetting Yeah yeah. Everybody else I ain't talking about you niggas When it comes to mixtapes You know I'll put, I I'll put Nip in there The Bullet yeah, Handle sure. Name Series The Crenshaw mixtape Which was the first Hundred dollar Proud to play and campaign Nip. Rest yeah. in peace Shit Nip. like that like, I ain't yeah, putting yeah, T.I. In so. no damn mixtape uh, Conversation That's me I ain't doing it Somebody from Atlanta Gotta school me Gucci I'll put, I I'll put in Gucci Migos, Migos mixtapes No label No label tool uh, YRN 
Those were the ones that had they slaps on it that took them to mainstream success. Yeah, you the mixtapes did it for a lot of what artists. What year was bro. that? Ooh, if this wasn't the end of the pod. 2010, I could remember? Really shake oh, the yeah, yeah, yeah. Where's the bar? Yeah. Really I was about to say, bro, bro, I'm better. Could really shake the table right now. But no. I ain't, ain't going to do it. <laughs> Oh my god, how am I missing a dipset mixtape series? Yeah. Oh yeah, that was stupid of us. Duh. Nicki Minaj mixtapes. Alright. Drake, so far gone mixtape. You talking about one that impacted and, and changed the game? That. Yeah. So far gone. So far gone. Like, yeah. That was, that was some slaps on there. <laughs> Love. <laughs> okay, poquito. Couple. She was all right. <laughs> I don't want to hear no so far gone from you niggas. That was me running around telling y'all, hey, this little singing Canadian nigga is going. <laughs> y'all all mach- machismo, machacho, macho men. Tell them, nah, you listen to that pansy shit? Yeah. It worked. Yeah. Best I ever had. <laughs> yeah, it worked. Fact. He was right. It worked. Yeah, I hope he answered your question. Yeah. I might have to go do some research on this T.I. mixtape you should be talking about. I don't land on that shit. <laughs> Fuck these niggas talking about. No, Joe Biden. Enough, Daddy.